Hi everyone, I hope you having a good day today, and welcome back to my another video. In tutorial I will show you how to update old iPad to iPad OS 17 on unsupported iPad. As you can see, I cannot update my software update. I don't get notification for updating my iPad in stock. If you want to update your iPad feature, you need a computer to update your iPad. Please plug your USB cable to PC and install Triudo software on your PC. Please launch the Triatools after you have success installed Triudos on your PC. And then connect your iPad to Triudos, and you will see a full spec for your iPad on Triatools. And then please click Jailbreak Now button, and click on the Jailbreak available for your iPad, and click Start Jailbreak on the bottom. After process jailbreak success, go back to your iPad and go to Profile Management on Settings and click Trust the App. For example, I installed Phoenix apps on my iPad. Please click the Phoenix for jailbreaking your iPad. Start jailbreak the iPad and your iPad will restart automatically after jailbreak success. After I start success, and you will see a CDA app after jailbreak. Upgrade. Please launch the CDA. Please upgrade essential to use jailbreak feature. And then go to the source menu clicked edits on the top and add URL. And please add the URL to the box. They call it boiling. Please check full rip pulling on the description of this video. I have inserted the rip pulling on the description. After that, did you know that Apple has released the last iPad OS app? iPad OS 17? So how do you get the old iPad to update it to the new iPad OS A and get the last feature from iPad OS on your iPad? Follow the tutorial how I get it on my unsupported iPad. Please check this out. Go to search box and please search Eclipse Dark Mode. Eclipse Dark Mode, that is tweaks, can allow you to add dark mode feature on your iPad. You can enable dark mode feature on general setting, and also you can select a specific apps to turn on dark mode. And then the second tweaks, please search and add Medusa for iPad. Medusa for iPad, that is tweaks can allow you to enable slide over and split view from the iPad. And then you can make the iPad a multitasking, exclusive feature for all iPads. It means you can make the iPad a multitasking at the same time. It is absolutely best tweaks for all iPads. Please install Medusa for iPad on your iPad. Okay, the third tweaks, you need to do a speed intensifier tweaks. You can add and install speed intensifier tweaks on search box. Speed intensifier can allow you to speed up performance of your iPad. You can speed up system animation such as opening and close, loading indicator, navigation, and a lot of more. This is the important tweaks must installed on your old iPad. If your iPad is lazy, you need to speed intensifier to fix the performance. And the fourth tweaks, please install CC settings. You can search the CC settings directly on search box. CC settings is control center manager for iPad. You can custom control center, looks like amazing. And also, 
you can add more Control Center shortcut on your iPad. Okay, the first tweaks, let's install spin setting. You can search directly on search box. No more special with these tweaks. Just you can make the settings icon become spinning and it make your homepage more aesthetic. Okay, on the six tweaks, I recommend you to install Harbor Tweaks. Harbor is the ultimate dog tweak inspired by Mako as a feature. It allows you to place a nearly unlimited amount of icon in the dark. It is the important tweaks for your old icon. The seven tweaks, please install Iconizer. Please search on search box. Iconizer is all in one tweaks, which give you full control springboard icons. With Iconizer, you can customize your icons instantly. You can customize the color of a size and more of the icon. And also, you can add animation to the icon, such as border, filter, and many more. That is all in one tweaks on your iPad. You have to install these tweaks Okay, in the eight tweaks, please install Send HTML. Did you know a widget like iOS 15? Yeah, with Send HTML, you can add the widget on all iPad. You can add widgets such as weather, music, background animation, lock screen, and many more. You can download it directly on Searchbox of Cedia. Okay, that is the tweaks I recommend you to install on your iPad, but I have a lot of tweaks you need to install to upgrade your iPad. But I can't explain all of the tweaks here. You can get more info about the tweaks on Reddit. Come, or you can watch my other video on Apple J YouTube channel. I have so many tweaks there. You can check the link download on description. Okay, thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel for more updates. See you on the next tutorial. Bye bye.